Good morning, you guys. I just got back from the gym. Today's video is just gonna be like a self-care day. So I'm gonna start with taking a shower, then I'm gonna do my hair and my skincare. The first thing to do is to always make sure you're drinking water. Recently, since I moved down to Colorado, I've been drinking less and less water. I used to drink about three to four of these, and this is 62 ounces, and I've maybe drank in one, so. Number one, drink lots of water because that just makes you feel better and you don't get chap lips, dry skin. I'm gonna get dressed and then I will be back. Okay right, guys, I just finished getting dressed. My hair is still pretty damp, so I'm gonna do my hair routine that I do. So I use, it's a 10, <coughs> Royal Plex number seven. And then I use this that my sister gave me, the Vegamore hair serum, just because um, my hair has been like thinning for some reason and sometimes I'll get like random like bald patches. So that is what I'm gonna do right now. Um, and then I will brush my hair after. And then when I was off camera, I did put this all over my body. It's pretty much empty. This is the Jergens Skin Firming. And then I put this on like my arms and my neck. I'm gonna start with my Vegamore Hair Serum first. And then I'm going to use my It's a 10. And then lastly, the number seven. And then I'm actually gonna do some Dutch braids. I like to do that to just have my hair <coughs> kind of wavy. So when I get out of the shower, it's like somewhat damp. So I'm gonna brush it, split it into two, and then I will Dutch braid it. I'm gonna start with my right side because it is the one that I struggle with the most and then I just tied up the left side in a hair tie. I'm gonna be looking at the mirror over here just because I can't really see with the viewfinder. I'm just gonna break it into three sections. This is just like a really easy way to get like waves in your hair without putting any heat. I rarely put heat in my hair and this just gives it that crimped look without having to put heat. I do have that crimp tool. I've had it since I was in high school. And I'm just taking the hairs under. And I don't know if that like makes a difference as far as like what the waves will look like, but I just find this a lot easier. be perfect but not going anywhere usually I do this at night time when I'm gonna go to bed and then I'm just gonna close it off with a clear elastic so it's not perfect like I don't know if you guys can see, but like this piece is sticking out, but it'll still make my hair wavy the next day. Then I just go to the other side and do the same thing. And now that I'm done, I'm just gonna close off this one with a hair elastic. Okay. And now that I finished, I like to leave them really tight just because it makes the waves a little like, closer together. And because I have really straight hair, it usually falls out. So they end up being pretty loose. And um, now I'm gonna do my skincare that I do. I don't do too much to my skin. I have been blessed with having like an acne spot maybe like once a month, not even that sometimes. So I don't really put too much stuff on my face. And I don't do this routine every day, but I do put lotion on every day, especially in the mornings, just so my face can be nice and hydrated because it is very dry here. So the first thing I do, which I only do this when I take a shower, so I don't like to put this on too much, but I use this Paula's Choice um, liquid exfoliant. 
and I put this on a cotton pad and I just put it on I guess you would say your t-zone because I don't really feel like I need it anywhere else and then I rub it down my neck I don't know why so I guess my whole entire face <laughs> but I mostly focus on like my nose and my forehead and like it still comes off like a little bit dirty even though I washed my face in the shower and in the shower I use this CeraVe facial cleanser that my sister left and now I have acquired it so use that in the shower and then I just basically do my lotions that I use literally every day this is the eye repair cream by CeraVe or CeraVe and then just the daily moisturizer Quite a bit. And let's just go all over my face. Down to the neck. And then just the rest of my hands. So that's literally all I use on my face. And I will just put some chapstick on just because my lips do get very chapped. Again, have some water. Drink your water. I've been slacking. And then I will just put my deodorant on. I use this crystal, like all natural mineral deodorant stick. Which if you use this, like the first week and then like the second week on and off, you will smell like whatever your regular BO smell smells like. But then you just keep using it, using it. I use it every day. Every use I wash it. So I'll wash it to begin with, rub it, wash it, rub it, and then wash it again and put it away. But yeah, I love it. I don't use any other deodorant besides this. And I feel like my armpits never stink. Like I've probably used this now for, I would say a month. I think since I moved down here, which I leave almost been here for a month. I've been just using this and at first the week I was like I stink like I just wanted to use my Dove spray that I always use. Sorry guys I went to go eat my crunch wrap that my husband came home with. I didn't know he was coming home. It's quite early. It's only 10. Oh my gosh it's only 10 o'clock and he's already home. <sighs> but anyways talking about this. This is amazing. You guys should try it out and you just rub it like all over your underarm. And I rub it for like 10 seconds. Maybe less than that, actually. But I wash it between each use. But yeah, I used to use, which I still have it. I used to use this Dove one, which is like aluminum-free. It's like a spray one. This one's good, and like you won't stink. And then I tried the Native, and I just like, this one's just really messy, and I feel like it didn't work. This one worked, but I feel like anytime I used it, I would get like excruciating pains under my armpits, or they'd be like really itchy, and I just don't use it anymore. I still have them in case, I don't know, like this one my sisters can use or something. Emergencies, I don't know. And then this one's just, it's just messy. Oh, it's brown. Definitely wasn't brown when I first got it. That's weird. It smells amazing. You'll smell amazing. But I just, I feel like it was too messy. Yeah, I use this crystal. I love it. And I do have it on like a, like a ring tray in my drawer just because it is, it says not to put it on like granite countertops. I swear it said it on here, not to put it on like granite countertops. So I just put it on this. And then I just do this with this thing that I bought that's broken. I had it for about like three years ago. It's that Nurse Jamie thing, but sometimes I just roll it. I'm pretty sure it does absolutely nothing to my face. Um, I actually have two of these because I believe I originally got this one in one of those little bead things came out so then i wrote sephora and i told them like i barely had it for two days and one of the little bead things came out and so they said they'll send me a new one so i got this one and then literally that day that i used it it broke so i have two and i have no idea what this does i know it was popular like years ago i think because like the kardashians used it or something like that um, but I'm pretty sure it does nothing, but it's fun to use. And I feel like on a self-care day, you know, you want to treat yourself. I feel like when I do this, I like lose my eyes, my eyelid. Um, but yeah, just roll this all over my face. These are expensive, so I would not recommend. But I don't know what they do. Use this sometimes. 
times. Again, I don't know if it does anything. I'm probably doing it wrong. And then, last thing I do are these. This is the Grande Brow, and this is the Babe Lash. And then this one. And obviously, I use this one for my lashes, and I use this one for my brows. Um, I have this thing, which you guys probably noticed, um, where I pull up my eyelashes which is not great it's not fun and i get embarrassed by it but i can't help it i think it's called like trichotillomania or something like that so i use this to help me grow them back and it helps me a lot it still takes a long time for them to like grow back when i completely pull them out but once i get like a little bit of stubble when i use this like they get super long and this is just helps with my brow because i don't know you guys ever noticed but like this brow for some reason has like a bald spot right there and i don't know why so i use this to grow them out so i'm gonna put this on and i highly recommend both of these products because they literally changed my life my sister got me onto the grande brow the bait lash i have used for many years the bait lash is expensive very very expensive i think it's almost as expensive as the grande lash one they have but i just need it it helps me feel better when i have no lashes i look like a crazy person so i just put a little bit on this one is finally growing back i pulled them out like a week ago and then this one i pulled out like two days ago so i'm just trying to make them grow back because I look crazy. In high school, I used to just put black eyeliner just like on my top lid to like camouflage it because in high school and middle school, I used to rip off the top and the bottom so my eyes just looked bizarre. So I've gotten better. I mean, it's still pretty bad, but I've gotten better at like controlling myself to not rip them all off. Like, some of these still have like pretty long lashes. Like this eye I did two days ago. So like all those are on lashes that I already have and I haven't pulled them out. So improvement. But yeah, that is all that I do. I was gonna make breakfast and my husband brought me a crunch wrap and I ate that in like two minutes. So that's all I have. Um oh I also recommend get a tongue scraper if you're doing like a self-care, like let's say you're doing this in the morning, you still need to brush your teeth, get this. This has changed my life. I love this thing. I use it every morning. And it just gets rid of like all the germs on your tongue. It's way different than using like a toothbrush. I just feel like it just like gets everything. That's all I do. Mm, I'm trying to think I'm forgetting anything. I don't think I am. But yeah, I'm just gonna relax and I guess edit this video. And then I have to edit a TikTok that I have to post. Just treat yourself if you guys are watching this. Um, drink water, eat some good food, fuel your body, just treat your skin. Even if you don't have any of these fancy products, just put a lotion on. Start with something small or, you know, just wash your face with water. In the mornings, I wash my face with just cold water and I put lotion on. Just brush my teeth, of course, but that's literally all I do. And I just feel like it just helps and, you know, it just makes you feel better. I know, just doing like small little things just to treat yourself and it's free and just get some lotion. I think that'd be great lotion. This is literally not even that expensive. Just get some CeraVe, get out of the shower, put this all over your body. You'll be good. But yeah, I really hope you guys have a great day. And I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys in my next video. And don't forget to drink water. And don't forget to subscribe. Also, any products that I put in this video, they are all on my Amazon storefront. They should be under like health and beauty, I believe. And yeah, I believe you can get Babe Lash on Amazon. I think that's where I used to get it from, if I'm not mistaken. But I know you can also like, because it's the holiday season, sometimes Babe Lash website also gives you like discount codes. I think that's where I got that one. I think it was during some type of sale they were having. Um, I bought that one from the actual website, but I believe you can get it on Amazon. If you guys just want regular long lashes, I feel like I used to do it in high school a lot. And I feel like my lashes, and I used to put mascara on top of it, and they were just like, like they were like touching my eyebrows. Like when I would lift my eyes, they were like up there. So I recommend that. But yeah, you guys have a great day and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.